Let's go granular on Test Act. And uh, Test Act is a great uh, text preparation software, but uh, is it really worth it? And all the buzz we hear about, is it really worth it? So we're going to have a clear conversation about Test Act today. So what's the bottom line? So the bottom line here is that Test Act really guides both new and experienced users through the process of filing your taxes online every single year. And uh, so what we love about Test Act is that uh, it has a great user interface. So UI and UX are fantastic. Okay, you have great user interface, you have navigation options, fantastic. You have thorough coverage of tax topics, fantastic. You also have an excellent final review of your tax return. So this is really uh, this is really cool. And Test Ad, by all means, based on our research, is cheaper than several of, it, of its competitors, and it offers affordable access to tax pros as well. And so who should really use Test Ad really? If you're listening to me right now, you know, if you're a confident tax filer, who wants to maximize your refund with deductions you might not have previously considered, you may enjoy Test Act. And when reviewing your return, Test Act's deduction maximizer tool allows actually you to uh, get in, like to really see exactly, to have a, your a bird's eye view of your tax return. And actually the, the tool may offer uh, customized deduction suggestions based on your personal situation. That said, you'll still need a good grasp of tax rules to make necessary changes though. Okay, so this is really important. And one thing I want to say here is that uh, if you're looking for a bargain alternative to TurboTax and h and Block, you can definitely give Tax Act a try. But Tax Layer is a bit cheaper and offers a similar experience with more add-on help options. It's really one of those things where you have to see what applies to your situation. So who should not really use Tax Act? Well, those who fully, uh, who want to fully, uh, let's say if you're looking for a fully free tax software, you should look elsewhere. Because for a tax ad, you're paying like 40 to 50 bucks for state returns. And uh, so it's one of those things where you can't really use tax ad if you want a free a, a free uh, tool such as uh, Cash App Taxes. And so if you're looking for a live chat support, you should try TurboTax, h and Block, or Cash App Taxes, which actually include both free federal and state returns. And uh, so, if that, so this is really good. Now, fans of advanced security features should also pass on tax ad. Because uh, really, uh, it supports two-factor authentication with Google Authenticator, but none of the, the standard MFA login features like verifying a security code with your mobile phone. And TaxLayer and Jackson Hewitt both offer much more robust security features. By the way, boss, welcome back to the show. It's really a pleasure to have you here. Make yourself comfortable. You are going to enjoy today's conversation. Let me give you a deeper review, an in-depth review of a test app. I want to really talk about the pros and cons so we have a clear idea about the, the, the tool we're talking about. I want to first start with the pros. So when you think about tax app, you have good user experience. I've said this before, UX and UI are just fantastic. You have a, a logical organization of uh, tax topics. We love that a lot. You, have, uh, you are able to get digs for income and deductions. You have context-sensitive uh, help. This is kind of cool because uh, you are you you do not want to like know the RRC, the RRC the Internal Revenue Code. You want the software to let you know, basically to break it down for you, right? And Tax Ad does a great job in terms of breaking it down for you. So this is kind of fantastic. You have free professional help for, through uh, expert assist. So what we love about Tax Ad also is that it's very it's relatively easy to jump between sections without reporting without actually uh, reporting uh, the same information several times without also repeating uh, interview questions. You also have free support from CPAs, enrolled agents, and tax attorneys for everyone through Tax Ads, and you can also import an electronic copy of your W two into the software. So this is kind of cool. That ability to do that it really it's a, it's a big time saver especially if you actually have uh, multiple w2s because the last thing you want to the, the last thing you want is actually uh, to uh, manually input all the data manually key in all the data about that that's found on your w2s this can be this can be a pain so those are the pros what about the cons here so basically uh many help links lead to irs documents so in other words uh task ad doesn't have uh, 
the breadth and depth in terms of expertise to write content to, to, that relates to those topics. So they would rather just direct you to uh, the IRS. So and we and we all know how uh, how legible the IRS documents are. I mean, the IRS documents are like uh, legalese. So you got to have a certain background to understand what the uh, what those documents are talking about. And it, it will be nice to have something that like. H&R Block or TurboTax, where you actually have content that's written by uh, by the software provider themselves, so they really sort of break it down for you. But Tax Out right now doesn't have it, and search results are not always targeted, and uh, you also have expensive per state filing, and you have higher fees for state returns compared to competitors across the board. Across the board. And you have a, the frequent offers to upgrade or upsell services. It's one thing that you will see a lot in task app. They're trying to really upsell you all the time. They're trying to really, 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 really upsell you. And this is really annoying. So task app, please re just reduce that. And you can file using the mobile app, but only if you fit a certain uh, profile. Boss, I want to quickly remind you of today's topic. We are having a conversation about task app. So this is a task app review. Let me give you the specs you need to be aware of as you consider following with tax ad this year. So tax ad really, when you think about it, it's uh, you have, you're able to import competitors' returns. You have all major IRS forms and schedules, and you have a comprehensive navigational uh, outline. And so tax ad actually has roots that go back more than 30 years. Okay. And uh, so when you really think about it, it's a reliable and thorough tax preparation service with a large potential audience of taxpayers, including W-2 earners who want to itemize self-employed individuals, small businesses, part-time marketplace sellers, and gig workers. So this is kind of important. And uh, so because of its excellent tax content, support, and uh, usability, tax ad, in our view, remains today, as of today, one of the best tax preparation services in uh, in, in the country. So this is kind of cool. And the, the cool thing here is that tax ad really works in a very, uh, in a very simple way. So Basically, like its competitors, it is an online version of all those paper documents you would otherwise need to assemble to do your tax preparation. So if you have a complicated financial life and have uh, ever tried to complete your return on paper, you know how frustrating and time consuming it is to keep flipping back and forth between, let's say, forms and schedules, doing all your calculations and transferring the correct numbers to your 1040 form. Right. You know, this is just uh, crazy. So test ad actually makes this grueling process more organized and manageable. So just as a human being in a tax prep tax preparer's uh, office would do, it interviews you to get all the information needed to complete your return, taking you through a lengthy step-by-step -step wizard. So all you need to do is to answer the questions on each page before you advance to the next. Very, very, very simple, right? And so as, as you enter information, what happens here is that test ad will do the necessary calculations and will put your numbers on the right lines on the appropriate forms and schedules and and uh, at almost every step it offers support of one kind or another so after you visit every topic applicable to your situation test ad goes through your return and alerts you to potential problems before allowing you to uh, e-file or print out paper returns to mail so you're not asked to pay until this point as uh, this is typical for with uh, those services so it's kind of similar to what uh, HNL Block does what uh, TurboTax does, and so on and so forth. So to get started with TaxAd, it's very simple. You just have to sign up, go to their website, and just sign up. And uh, in terms of a reporting income and expenses with TaxAd, this happens through as you go through the process, the, the Q and A, and then basically uh, you just uh, enter your W two information and so on and so forth. You're able to double check your returns with TaxAd, not a problem. And you and TaxAd also uh, has a, a special program that uh, handles uh, self employment properly. Okay. And in terms of uh, in terms of other other services you may get through tax ad, you really need to uh, basically it depends on your situation and also on your specific state. So every every state is different. But uh, one thing I want to say here is that um, there is a, a a free a free tool called Expert Assist. So you are able to actually see exactly what kind of help you need based on uh, your situation. Let's talk about a differentiator here. So when you think about Tax Ad, you can actually file for free. Okay, you can file for free with Tax Ad, but only your federal return and only if you fit a specific profile. So taxpayers with the simplest returns, generally this means W-2, unemployment, and retirement income, 
claiming the standard deduction and the earned income tax credit and child tax credit qualify for free federal filing with tax act. And so state returns will cost you an additional $39 to $59 per state if you qualify for free federal filing. And if you need to, let's say, to upgrade to the deluxe, premier, or self-employed versions, you'll pay about $44 to $59 per state, which can get expensive for people who need to file several state returns. And uh, so, and what happens here is that if your employer participates, you can import uh, an electronic copy of your W-2 into tax ad, not a problem. So the thing that what happens here is that when you import your W-2, all of the relevant information will automatically populate in the relevant fields, saving you from having to manually and enter it. And uh, tax ad does offer also, uh, thank God, I mean, they didn't have, they, they, they weren't, they didn't do it like a couple of years ago. Now they're doing it. So this is just fantastic. So they offer a mobile app. And uh, so the Test at Express app is available for iPhone and uh, Android, but not all Test at customers will be able to file using the app. Currently, it only covers W-2 income, child tax credit, child and dependent care, care credit, education credits and deductions, premium uh, tax credit. You also have uh, interest and dividend income, unemployment compensation, earned income tax credits. You also have savers and retirement credit. So it's one of those things where depending upon your situation, you might qualify or not qualify. And what I want to say here also is that if you are self-employed, have capital gains or losses, have income from a rental property or pass through a business or a more complicated tax situation, you will need to file using the out, the, uh, the online version. Okay. It's one of those things where it really depends upon your situation. Boss, I want to quickly remind you of today's topic. We are having a conversation about tax at. So this is a tax at uh, tax preparation software review. Let me talk to you about the value added here. So when we talk about tax at, what what is the value added? Basically, tax at is really easy to use. They have worked a lot. In terms of UX, in terms of the UI, this is really cool. And uh, what we love is that the, the way it works is that basically, uh, if you have actually uh, filed with tax ad before, you will start by importing last year's return to reduce errors. Otherwise, you will fill out a questionnaire asking basic questions about your relationship status and your dependents. Then what happens here is that you will proceed to the tax forms where you will add information about your, your W-2s and any other tax related questions. Where, where, where the, the software really adds value is how easy it makes the whole process, how seamless it makes the whole process. Okay, Qu- questions are phrased simply and tax jar- jargon is really kept at a minimum. So this makes the process of filling your taxes generally seamless. And you simply answer questions and your return gets filled in behind the scenes. Like with other tax software, you'll answer questions about your income, deductions, and credits. Okay, so this is really uh, this is really uh, cool. And uh, so now there is no option to downgrade to a lower tier software once a filer has started their return or chosen to upgrade. So just be aware of that. And so if you don't want to file with your upgraded software, you'll have to start from scratch. So be sure to choose the right software before you get started. And uh, so basically, Test Ad actually has a, a similar look and feel to competitor's product with an interview process guiding you through it. And uh, you can skip around more easily than most, okay? And so this is kind of cool. And embedded links throughout offer tips, explainers, and other resources and the help center links to a searchable knowledge base. And uh, a shopping cart icon at the top tells you which package you are buying, whether you have you also a selected add-ons, and how much your total software bill is so far. And so basically, uh, there are some handy features that we we really love in the test ad. Basically, you can switch from another provider, not a problem. You have you can auto import certain tax documents, so you can import, as I said, W twos or take a photo of them via the app or for upload. You can upload 1099B information from your broker if you have an express sheets, a CSV file. All of this lets you avoid spending time keying keying in numbers from little boxes. You also have a donation calculator and you also have also the the, uh, the mobility. So the platform is kind of mobile. So this is another value that tax ad really really adds to uh, to your tax situation. What about pricing here? Let's talk about pricing. So test at pricing. So basically test at offers a four package tiers, depending on the top 
or tax forms you need. And this prices reflect the list prices that basically uh, they actually advertise constantly. So it, it's always, you, so they have the free, the uh, deluxe, the self-employed and the premier. So the premier is actually the, the top of the top when it comes to a test ad. So when we talk about the free, the free package, basically you have a free filing of federal returns. And this covers W-2, unemployment and retirement income. You have earned income credit, child tax credit, and the standard deduction. And so, but the free is actually a $0 for federal, and but uh, it's like $39.95 to $59.95 per state. That's for the free. The deluxe, you are paying $24.95 federal and the $44 to or $59 per state. Here, this includes everything in the free package. Plus, this allows itemized deductions, the adoption credit, child and dependent care credit, student loan interest deduction and health savings account contributions and withdrawal. So this is some of, this is really an important element to pay attention to. And you also have the self-employed here. This includes everything in the premier package. Plus it really allows reporting of self-employment, business and farm income, business expenses and depreciation. So you have this sort of ability there. And in terms of prices here, you are paying 64 to $75 at the federal level. And uh, in terms of state, you're paying somewhere from 44 to 59 per state. And then you have actually the premier. Actually, the premier is uh, the the top of the top, but it really depends upon what you're looking for, though. So this includes everything in the deluxe the the, the lux package. Plus, this allows you to report capital gains and losses. And it allows also reporting of income and expenses from rental properties and pass-through businesses, sale of a home, and foreign bank and financial account reporting. So it's one of those things where you have more flexibility. Let's just say it this way. When it comes to the premier, you have more flexibility. And so the, the thing is, the bottom line is, if you only need to file a federal tax return or federal plus one state, that's that might be an affordable option, but its fees for state returns can be high depending upon uh, what you're actually looking for, okay? Let me give you an example. h and Block and Tax Layer offer free state returns for customers who qualify for the free version, while tax ad charges $39 to $49 uh, per return. So this could make tax ad more expensive for people using the actually uh, the free version or those who need to file returns in several states. Let's talk about the, the rivals before we close to this conversation. So when you think about test ad, you know, test ad actually is not the only player in this field. You have a lot of player, a lot of other players. You have uh, basically, uh, you have a H and R block, of course. You have uh, TurboTax, of course. You have, uh, you have uh, Liberty Tax, of course. So you have a lot of players here. The bottom line here is that you got to ask yourself, what kind of, uh, what kind of, uh, what are you paying attention to? Because uh, some uh, providers actually will give you, like test ad, is uh, cool when it comes to uh, the expert assist. So here you have uh, a tool that that gives you access to tax pros and uh, a final review. So this is kind of cool. If you go to H and R Block, for instance, you have online assist. It really uh, gets you on demand tax help, tax help also. And uh, so you always have this live assist. But the thing is that when you really think about uh, tax ad, you are thinking about uh, a tool that allows you. To file for free at the federal level that charges you at the state level so this is one of those things where we believe that for all intents and purposes there are other players i mean uh you know h and r block is better because they're not charging you anything at the state level and uh, you also have turbo tax which may be slightly more expensive but test ad really uh, provides more more help when it comes to uh those who have uh income below a hundred thousand dollars let me give you the extras before we close to this conversation here. So when we when we think about tax ad, it, it is a, a tool that is easy to use. It is safe to use. As I said before, at, when I started this conversation, tax ad has been in, in this business for 30 years. I mean, that 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 really amounts to something. 30 years in the business, that's really cool. So it's really, uh, it's, the, the company has uh, all the all the safety measures, uh, you know, in place. I mean, they work with the IRS and state authorities to comply with generally accepted procedures and practices for both physical and online security. So the the software the, this software provider has implemented multiple safety features to ensure that you are the verified account owner. So password requirements are complex, and your account is further protected through multi-factor authentication, 
so MFA, either uh, using unique security codes sent to your phone and email or via, uh, you know, an authenticator app on your smartphone. So this is kind of cool. So you have this flexibility there. So we, we love that a lot. And in terms of uh, the support options, you have a lot of support options. You can get help. Uh, actually, uh, you, you know, you have free tech support by chat or phone for, for all. This is kind of cool. You also have, a, you know, the human help. So if you like, if you need really like, if you have a, a question about stuff, you really can reach out to somebody, not a problem. And if you are audited also, this is kind of a possible for you to get the, the help that you need. Totally possible, not a problem. So what is our verdict here? Basically, uh, you know, across the board, test ads offerings are less expensive than similar products from competing providers. And uh, so this is kind of cool. And so if you actually, uh, if you're looking for help, and you are looking for usability, you're looking for user friendliness, you will love test ad. We actually, uh, do we actually uh, recommend it? Yes, we recommend test ad. We, we love the, the sleek design. We love, we love the UI and the UX user experience and user interface. Fantastic. The help panel is, uh, is uh, sleek, beautiful. You have the expert, expert assist uh, tool. It's also really great. So fantastic. So yes, we do, uh, we do recommend test ad. Thank you so much for your attention. I really appreciate it. Into this conversation, I'll do, I was just doing a quick test ad review. So uh, let me quickly recap here. So I gave you, uh, I spoke about, I gave you the uh, the bottom line here, the review, the specs, the differentiator, the value added, the uh, the pricing. I spoke about the rivals, the extras, and the verdict. Thank you so much. God bless you. I'll speak to you another time. Until then, remember, stay marvelous. <laughs>